Hello friends, uh, today we will see how to deploy the Laravel application on Ubuntu instance. So we have the AWS account, uh, so I logged in in Mumbai region. So we will deploy the Ubuntu applications on Ubuntu instance, uh, Laravel application on Ubuntu instance. So for that uh, we will click on launch instance, after that we will search here Ubuntu and we will select this image this is free tier so after that uh, we will uh, select the T2 micro then we will select the ability zone IP should be enabled then add the storage so in this case we will take uh, the storage at as 8 GB in your case uh, you can take according to your requirement we will add uh, the tag here so I am adding the tag name here Laravel app then we will uh, add the security uh, group so here uh, uh, we, uh, we are taking the SSH and HTTPS so if you require uh, the port uh, like database if you want to add or something so according to you can take I uh, mean enable the port so then launch instance you can select uh, the new, you can create a new uh, key pair or uh, existing I have the existing key pair so I am selecting this and launching the instance okay now view instance okay so we have uh, the Laravel app and uh, it is in pending state so it will take uh, one or two minutes so we will wait for that uh, or we will pause the video okay so it is now in running state and initializing so meanwhile I'm trying to take uh, the we will copy this public IP address of our instance then we will open the putty and as uh, we are selected the Ubuntu instance so I will give the username Ubuntu at the rate then IP address then appearance then I will select the font size then SSH auth then I will select the key pair then I will log in into the server so I will press control plus L so screen uh, will clear so after that we will switch to root user sudo su then we will update our server apt get update dash y so it will update our server it is updated now I will update upgrade uh, my system server so apt upgrade that's why so now it is updating uh, the server so today we are configuring the Lara, uh, Laravel uh, uh, latest Laravel application on Ubuntu server so through that if you want to deploy uh, the Laravel application so for that uh, you need to configure the Laravel environment in your server so that we are configuring okay now uh, we can ins we will install the Apache and then we will install the PHP so we have the command 
so I just copy this command and right click the mouse button and enter so it will start installing the PHP after that uh, we will go in php.ini file and we will increase our memory size so that uh, it will not uh, give uh, any error or uninstallation failed something like that because in uh, in our case we are taking free tier 1 GB RAM so uh, it may uh, show error that's why we will increase the memory size uh, yeah okay but if you take the 4GB uh, 4GB RAM server so in that case it will not throw any error so uh, we are taking one uh, one GB server uh, one GB RAM server memory server that's why we will add it in php.ini file so still it is installing the PHP so we will wait for some time Yes, now it uh, get installed. Yeah, so PSP uh, get installed. So if you want to check if it is installed or not, so you need to run PHP. So we can able to see PHP is installed. So and now uh, we will uh, go in this file. through vi command we will open this and we will press i so i will come in insert mode and i will come down so here we will add it uh, something Yeah, so here we will add it the memory limit so I will make it uh, you can make it 600 700 1200 anything but more than uh, 520 means uh, more than 500 something Yeah, so post max size also I will make it 600 uh, this is uh, the maximum upload site when we install the uh, p means MySQL so in that case if you uh, want to upload the uh, database size more than 2 GB so that you can give so in that case I am giving 1 GB or if you want to give 10 GB then 10 GB you can give so like that okay so so it is done so I will press escape button then colon then WQ enter okay so again I will come here and uh, I will uh, start uh, the uh, system CTL start Apache 2 ok then system CTL enable Apache 2 ok so now it is enabled so then we will install the composer okay Larvik, uh, then we will install composer so for composer we will paste this command then uh, it is saying uh, executable permission on composer so we will enter this okay so now oh, you now you can check the composer version by this command okay so it is asking you want to continue with root yes so it is showing 2.1 version 
okay then we will go in HTML command CD where www HTML okay so then we will create the our Laravel project so com uh, for that compose create project Laravel slash uh, Laravel then we will give the project name okay so whatever project name you have so that you can give like uh, okay so I'm here uh, taking the project name only then I will enter then okay yes so it will uh, start installing the Laravel so it is installing the Laravel 8, 8 version okay yeah now everything is installed then we will go in inside project name okay then we will if you want to check the if uh, which Lara version is installed or something so PHP partition so that you can see Laravel framework 8.69 version is installed okay then control L then we will change the owner of the project name okay we will change the owner of project name to www data colon www data okay ch owner okay ownership we will check change the ownership of our, of our project like if you want to see the current owner name dash l so current owner name it is showing uh, root root owner name is showing okay group and owner and group both showing uh, root so we will convert it into www data okay so i will copy this command ch owner okay ch owner www data so again if i will check see here uh, now it is ownership and group both got changed into www data okay then i will uh, give the permissions a specific permission to the uh, storage so for that we will run this command ch mode r775 and this now ownership got changed now we will create the virtual host for this uh, project and we will paste this one so I will paste this uh, virtual host thing in command means uh, description so here you need to give the IP address of your server okay so if you using uh, the load balancer in that case you need to give your load balancer IP address okay uh, if you configuring your uh, application so I'm taking this public IP address of our server okay now it's given now control X then Y then enter okay then I will run this command a2 inside laravel config now it is showing to reload the apache 2 ok so I am reloading this so again right so I am running this command so it is saying to restart the apache so I will restart the apache ok now we will check our server IP address in browser ok then we will paste our server IP address see now you can able to see the laravel now our laravel application is configured with this version ok now you can deploy your application in this server ok so configuration is done history if you want to see the commands so this command we run ok 
थैंक यू